Iowans have been offering to share their medicine with a three-year-old Osceola girl battling cancer. Kinsley Delzell's doctor had told her family that the hospital might only have enough of the chemotherapy drug methotrexate for one more treatment, but unfortunately, hospital officials tell us that federal guidelines do not allow for Good Samaritans to donate their unused drugs for Kinsley. Now, Kinsley has been undergoing treatment at Blank Children's Hospital in Des Moines since last November. She's in the middle of a nine-week therapy regimen that includes a high dose of methotrexate, and her family worries where the hospital will get future doses amid a nationwide shortage of the drug. Kinsley's doctor explained why this is so challenging. Her case is unique in the sense that the children who get who are, have high-risk leukemia, who either don't clear their bone marrow in the first 28 days or walk in the door by age or by the amount of leukemia in their bloodstream, they automatically get assigned to a high-risk group and they get a higher dose of that drug that requires them to be admitted to the hospital and get it. Now the hospital, like others facing shortages, can try to get a limited emergency supply from a drug supplier or possibly get some from another hospital. Meanwhile, we told Senator Chuck Grassley's office about Kinsley's situation and his staff asked us to connect them with Kinsley's family to see if they could help.